fans, thank you for joining us. It's the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Brian Anderson with Clark Kellogg and Grant Hill. Allie LaForce with us on the sidelines. It's the Toronto Raptors and the Miami Heat. So the Raptors starting five. And you know, guys, Wade is a terrific teammate, always willing to give up the ball and share the sugar, if you will, especially when his teammate is wide open. Here's McGrady. O'Neal pulls it in. Boy, he's got to be kicking himself for failing to make that shot. That's money. Pass to Williams. Here's Wade. And he drives in. Back to Williams. Off target from outside. Here's Bogues. Williams defending. Bogues, the pass to McGrady. Davis with a screen on Walker. Heat's foul call. Jason Williams. First personal foul. First team foul. And just about a minute into this first quarter. Pass to McGrady. Six on the shot clock. Davis with a screen on Walker. From 13, jump shot is good. McGrady. Yeah, McGrady inside is confident, using his outstanding length to get the shot he wants and to get it off. From deep three-point land, they get the rebound. Boy, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Just great positioning to get the rebound, then get it back up. Here's McGrady. Walker covering. To the middle. Here's Oakley. Oh, and a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. Yeah, he doesn't throw it down much, but I love seeing Oakley hammer it down like that. Good job, Oak. Pass to Wade. And there's a pick. Here's Haslam. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Well, I'll tell you what, Haslam has a reputation as being a great teammate, a real professional. He does whatever is asked of him, whether it's on the court or off. down the first one. It's both from the stripe. Here's Bogues. Pass to McGrady. Here's Oakley. Right side, Carter. Just five to shoot. 17-foot shot on the way. Can't get his first shot of the game to fall. Well, the defense refusing to give up anything easy. Love seeing that kind of intensity. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Man, good whistle there. Yeah, you can hear the smack all the way over here where we are. At the line for Miami. You done as Haslam. Two shots. First one at the line is good. Oh, I got you, man. 
And so he makes both from the line. Toronto trailing. Here's McGrady. First quarter of play, and we're about three minutes in. Takes a 13-footer. Two points. That one goes. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Here's Wade. Williams on the wing. Miami, no good that time either. You gotta move past that one. I mean, they'd want him to take that again. Well, you know, I hear you. That's a good look, but when you're that wide open, I think you gotta knock it down. Davis with a screen on Walker. McGrady the pass to Davis. And it's out of bounds. The Raptors able to retain possession here. We're just over three and a half minutes into this first quarter. To the wing on the left. Five to shoot. Baseline try. The shot by Bogues, no good. The Heat with the lead. Walker passes to Wade. With the teardrop. Oh, nice D from Carter. Ooh, old school right there. No easy buckets. Down low, here's McGrady, and a strong finish with two hands. And I like seeing McGrady rise up for the dunk. He has amazing leaping ability and good reach, too. He makes it look easy. Here's Wade, he's checked by Carter. Wade, that's good. Boy, that was a sweet-looking teardrop. There's very little defense for that. Here's Bogues. He's scoreless. Right at the free throw line. Count that bucket. The entire defense was frozen footed. Nobody picked up the shooter. Here's Wade. Up and over Carter. Wade, that's good. Wade's got his second bucket on the night. Boy, you got to admire the mid-range game of Wade. Has this area of the floor on lock. I mean, incredibly efficient from here. Here's McGrady. Second shot opportunity. And it's Miami with a rebound. Boy, he's much better than that. Really no excuse for missing that lane. Right side, Williams. Pass to Wade. Here he goes. The kick out to Walker. On the wing, Wade. Clock at six. Screen by O'Neal. Back to Williams. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. And so Davis will bring it up for the Toronto Raptors. Trailing by two. On the attack, Carter. Pass to McGrady. Heat foul. You don't ask how far. First personal foul. Second team foul. Oakley. Five on the clock. Carter on the wing. From 18 feet away. Earning accolades for his scoring. Wade doesn't always get the credit I think he deserves at the other end of the floor. This guy can lock you down, too. Out to the right wing. 
Here's O'Neal. Checked by Davis. That shot is good by O'Neal. O'Neal's got six points. And here are the Raptors now. Four-point game. Here's McGrady. Six points for him. Good on the shot. Give him eight points now. Concentration on display. This is why McGrady's the top player in my mind. I mean, he makes tough, contested shots inside. Here's Wade to the inside. The kick out to Walker from deep. Gets the three to fall. And the Heat lead by five. You don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. There's a screen. Here's Carter. Well-placed jumper from the free throw line. This shot definitely in Carter's wheelhouse. The defense has to be better guarding this. Outside, Williams. Screen by O'Neal. Wade, the pass to O'Neal. Outside, Walker. The three. And the heat. Another three. You know, Walker is really reliable as a catch-and-shoot guy because he's thinking shot even before the pass gets there. Pass to Davis. Here's Oakley. Here's Bogues. With the drive. Ooh, a good look from Carter. And the Raptors getting another bucket right there. And Bogues is a crafty passer. Excellent court awareness and has a real knack for finding the open man. Here's O'Neal. Oakley with a rebound. Toronto trailing. Shot from the wing. Carter can't get it to go. Pass to Wade. Here's O'Neal. Checked by Davis. That shot is good by O'Neal. O'Neal's got eight points. Nice roll from O'Neal, and he is a major target in these screen and rolls. Here's Bogues. Williams defending. Carter with it. Low block shot. O'Neal pulls it in. O'Neal's got rebound number five here tonight. Here's Wade. Screen by O'Neal. Wade, the pass to Haslam. Here's O'Neal. Knocked away. Stolen by Carter. They've got numbers. Here's Oakley. Perfect night so far. Two for two. <laughs> Woo! His energy is unmatched. And you know you're going to get those buckets, guys, when you're quick to get out on the break. Get that ball up the court as fast as you can. And the Heat call time here. Teams changing it up here. And here are the Heat now. They lead by four. Here's Posey. Screen by O'Neal. Six to shoot from 12 feet. Up again. Controls the rebound and the putback. Ten points for him. You've got to admire and respect how Shaq fights for the rebounds there. I mean, he puts in the work to get those second chance looks. Pass to Christie. Here's McGrady. Give him eight. Knocks down the step back J. McGrady's got 10 points in the game. He's a potent mix of effort and ability. Hard to shut down a player of his caliber. Brown against Payton. Pass to Posey. Takes the three. And again, Miami with a triple. Really love watching Payton dish it out like that. He's a true floor general who does an outstanding job of getting his teammates the clean looks. Here's Christie. No made baskets yet. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. 
Terrific design and execution, leading to an opportunity right at the rim. Payton against Brown. Outside Payton. Tries the spin move. Takes one from 10 feet. Here's Haslam. Count it. One for one to start the game. And despite the height disadvantage, oh my, he just attacks that interior. You know what, guys, honestly, I didn't think he'd win that battle. I mean, that's a lot of height to give up. Here's Willis. The 11-footer. And too long on the shot. Inside, here's Peyton. Up and in on the layup. And now it's a nine-point heat lead. Really smart move by Peyton against contact. Getting around the defender into the basket. Here's Christie. No good. Misses at the buzzer. And so it's the Miami Heat with a nine-point cushion at the end of the quarter. And it's all due to their ability to own the paint. They've been dominant down low. And don't go far. We'll be right back. We welcome you back to second quarter action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for Miami? To me, it's been the ball movement. That's been the key. I mean, going from good to great, not settling for a good shot, making that extra pass, keeping the defense off balance, and taking great shots. <laughs> you know, another thing that has impressed me has been their numbers of points in the paint just dominating down there they're just getting whatever shot they want in close so on the floor for toronto to kick off the second quarter and it's carter in at the shooting guard position brown that's good pick works well there but the defense left a lot to be desired yeah that's not the defense you need you got to be tougher defensively here's morning And there are the Heat with another bucket. Boy, the interior game of morning. Really strong, solid, excellent at getting quality shots in close. Pass to Christie. Here's the pick. Here's Thomas. And Posey pulls it down. That's two points they should have had. I'm sure he'd love to get that look again. Now here's Peyton. Just over a minute has passed here in the second quarter. Here's Wade. And the Heat, another three. Hey, out at the arc, Wade is a pretty selective shooter. So when he goes up, you know he's feeling it. Pass to Christie. Let's go with a three. And it's Miami with a rebound. Boy, I'm absolutely shocked he didn't get that one to go. Usually, he's money from deep. Here's Morning. Posey, the pass to Morning. 11 feet out. And it's Thomas with the rebound. To the middle. Here's Christie. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. And, you know, Christie is a prototype 3 and D guy. I mean, plays his heart out at the defensive end and can knock down the 3 too. He misses the free throw. Wright checked in for Miami. He hits the second from the line. And so here is Miami. 
In the second quarter, they've given up just three points. Pass to Morning. It's right on the wing. Outside Payton. Shot clock at six. Here's Posey. Launches a three. Hauled in by Brown. Outside Carter. Fires from deep. Pure from three-point range. Carter's got seven. Hey, that stroke from Carter, as smooth as a baby's bottom. Pass to Posey. Back to Peyton. To the inside. Here's Morning. And it's Thomas with the rebound. Toronto trailing. Here's Christie. No good with the triple. Here's Wade. He has seven. Down low. Here's Posey. Count it. Two for four from the field now. D-Wade showing you his savvy at work, moving things around and opening up the floor for his teammates. Outside, Brown. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes play. Launches it. And it's Miami with a rebound. Hayden passes to Wade. Pass to Morning. And he goes in for the dunk. Boy, the aggressiveness of Morning inside, I like it. I mean, when he's this deep, he's looking to throw it down. Timeout, timeout. Now a timeout called by Toronto. Start it. He's checked in for right, and Williams is subbed in for Peyton. Here's Bogues. Williams defending. Over to the wing. Pass to Willis. Here's Bogues. Down to five on the shot clock. Fires from the wing. And again, Toronto no good. Tell you what, that is a missed opportunity for mid-range for sure. With as little defense as was shown, should have made that one. Out of bounds. It'll be Toronto's ball. The Heat making a switch here. Haslam's checked in. The Raptors also with a sub. Davis is checked in. Here's Bogues. Pass to Oakley. Here's Bogues. Over Williams. And that one's good. Bogues. Bogues has got his second bucket of the night. And here are the Heat now. It's a 10-point game. Williams with it. No points so far. Outside Walker. From behind the arc. He buries it from three. Ed Williams is a really crafty passer. When you're open, he'll get you the ball on time and on target. And there's the screen. Here's Carter. Count it. He's four for eight now. And so it's Williams with it. He brings it up for the Heat. They lead by 11. Pass to Wade. Let's the three fly. And the Heat, another three. Wade looking very relaxed and comfortable firing off the catch right there. All right, let's get a report from Allie. Well, debating the best players ever, there are different criteria. But Hall of Famer Dr. J said, quote, I think ultimately you have to have that crowning moment where you're a champion. And it's difficult. Sometimes it takes experiencing the loss and figuring it out before you can be successful. It's nothing you can assume or take for granted. Well, he got his at 83. Thanks, Alec. Here's Walker. After the basket by Toronto. Back to Wade. Pass to Williams. Clock at six. 
They set the pick. Fires it. Rebound by the Raptors. Oakley's got four rebounds now. Here's Christie. Williams defending. And that one good. Christie's got five. Hey, he's a value utility guy. Whatever you need, Christie can provide it. He's willing to do so, even chipping in scoring-wise. Now here's Williams. Get to see a basket. Here's Wade. Good. And it's Walker who picks up the assist. And Wade is really pouring it in right now. Wade's gotten five shots to fall in eight tries. Here's Bogues. Drives to the hoop. Missed inside. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. Here's Wade. 12 points for him. Pass to Williams. Six to shoot. Back to Wade. The three ball. Oakley with a rebound. Here's Christie. It's good. Doug He's Christie. got seven. The defense turns up the heat, but so does Christie. He takes it right to him. Now Walker. Nine points in the game. Pass to Haslam. On the wing, Wade. From down in the low post, it goes. And the Heat lead by 12. Tough make that time by Wade inside. Just outworked the defense that time. To the paint. Cuts off the pass. Driving in. And that one is stuffed right through. And that's what happens when you don't take care of the ball. Hey, that makes the turnover hurt even more. What? You, you mean the throw down at the end? I'll tell you what, fellas. I mean, the highlight shows are going to pain them even more. And Toronto calls time here. O'Neal, he's checked in for Miami. Peyton comes in for Wade. The pass to Oakley. Here's McGrady. He's got 10. And stolen by Williams. Nails it. And he's one for five with that one. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Here's McGrady. Walker covering. McGrady shot is off. Now here's Peyton. He's closely guarded. To the middle. Here's O'Neal. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Shaq, such a beast inside, which is why defenders elect to foul him there. That free throw misses. He's over seven feet tall and well north of 300 LBs. Shaq is a mountain of a man and as unique a big guy as we've had in the league in its history. But I think what makes him so special, he moves extremely well at that size. Wade, he's checked in for Peyton. Carter, he's checked in for Toronto. Second free throw, no good. And so here is Toronto. They trail by 16. Fast break Miami. Here's Walker. Lays it up and banks it in. 
Walker's got 11 points. Against contact, Walker can still be very effective. He can beat you a lot of different ways. Outside Carter. And the Raptors miss again. And Williams has got the ball here for the Heat. Pass to Walker. Here's Haslam. The kick out to Williams. This one for three. Sends it home from three-point land. Williams has got his second basket of the night. Boy, good work from the big, big man. Zach knows exactly when to find the open man. Outside Walker. Pass to O'Neal. Back to Walker. Outside, Williams. Just five on the clock. Boy, he overdid it there. Too much force on the foul, and he's called for the flagrant one. He might be lucky just to get a flagrant one there. Lots of contact on that play, and the officials could have gone with a more severe call. Well, he better be on his best behavior from this point forward. One more flagrant of any kind, and he's out of this game. That one's off. And he sinks the second. A minute 35 left in the second quarter. Here's Wade. He's got 16. And he makes it. Wade's got 18 points in the game. You know, for a guy who is listed at 6'4", Wade does an awful lot of damage inside. Uses his strength and leaping ability. Time called here. The Raptors decide to talk it over. And it's the Raptors with the ball. Bogues, the pass to Davis. Here's Bogues. Pass to Carter. Can they get it? Ooh, another basket for him. He's 6 of 11 now. I think you got to be up on Carter all the time before the catch. Outside, Williams. From downtown. It's hauled in by the Raptors. Here's Bogues. The baseline J is off the mark. Bogues is gone just two of six shooting. 33%. Here's Wade. He's checked by Carter. The shot's good. Wade's got 20 points. Wade catching them off guard that time with the nice dribble move. And it's the Raptors with the ball. Now here's Carter. He's got 14 Pass to Bogues. Back to Carter. Shot clock at five. With some arc. Haslam with a rebound. Haslam's got four rebounds now. Here's Wade. Oh, Carter with the block. And so it's the Miami Heat. 23 points to end the quarter. And their three-point shooting, a big reason they have a sizable lead. And more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way right after this.
And after a very lopsided first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly in the second. So it's Toronto now. We've got Walker, and it's Haslam in at the four-man position. That's the group on the floor for Miami. With the step back. Pass to Bogues. Here's McGrady. Walker covering. Davis with a screen on Walker. McGrady the pass to Davis. Now here's Walker. He's covered closely. Outside, Williams. The three. Knocks it down from distance. Williams has got eight. I mean, I guess they're willing to give him that shot. <laughs> they may want to rethink that strategy, though. To the wing, right side. Here's McGrady. Cans it from the wing. Doing what he can to help shrink the deficit. But it has to be a team effort. And so here is Miami. Outside, Williams. Pass to O'Neal. Shoots over Davis. Again, the Heat score. <laughs> Take a look at how Shaq owns the paint. Nobody's getting in his way inside. Here's McGrady. Walker covering. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Second personal foul. First team foul. Shooting for Toronto. Tracy McGrady at the line for two. First free throw is good. Boy, McGrady, an elite talent. I mean, a remarkable athlete. Tremendous bounce and speed and strength. And he continues to get better. And so he hits both. Third quarter of basketball. We're about a minute and a half in. Here's Wade. He's checked by Carter. From 15 feet away. And again, it's Miami converting. You know, Wade has the capability to put up big numbers. And clearly, he's showing it all in this one. Davis with a screen on Walker. McGrady the pass to Davis. Here's Wade. He's checked by Carter. The kick out to Williams. 4-3. The rebound by Carter. And so it's Carter who brings up the ball for the Toronto Raptors. And he lobs it up. Stolen. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Yep, that one's good. He can really read the floor. Precision pass in rhythm. Outside Carter. Spins to the inside. Here's Oakley. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Oakley's got six points. Well, the physicality and toughness that Oakley plays with is really unmatched. He welcomes the contact and powers through for the finish and never complains at all. And, you know, the defense to me looked like they were okay to let him prove he could make that shot. Pass to Bogues. Now Carter. Here's Oakley. Six on the shot clock. Here's Bogues. Deflected. Sending a statement with that rejection. O'Neal reminding everybody what a forceful defender he can be. Outside, Williams. Here's O'Neal. Oakley with a rebound. Oakley's got six rebounds now in the game. McGrady the pass to Bogues. We've gone about three and a half minutes here into the third. 
Oh, that one goes. Money Count it. Balls. Bogues has got his third bucket of the night. Beautiful touch that time from Bogues. Here's Wade. 22 points for him. Up and over Carter. The putback. Great positioning on the putback. Oh, phenomenal hustle. He has a knack for those boards. Man, he is tenacious when that ball goes up. That's what they've got him out there for, fellas. Now a timeout called by Toronto. Grady, the pass to Bogues. Down low. Oh, a big finish with a one-handed jam. He just rises up and throws it down hard with one hand. That is such a go-to move for him. He holds nothing back on those. Does it as well as anybody, fellas. Tremendous skill while in the air. And he just powered through contact trying to complete the play. Yeah, he almost got that one down. I mean, those are the kind of aggressive plays coaches love to see. A chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for the Heat. Well, you love their unselfish play. Keeping that ball moving, good shot to great. That's winning basketball. And, you know, they've done a fantastic job scoring inside as a result, finding plenty of opportunities to cash in near the hoop. First free throw is good. When you think about it, Dwayne Wade is just a winner. A guy any coach would love to have playing for him. No good on the second, so he hits one of two. A difficult situation for Toronto. Here's Bogues. Six points for him. Over Williams. The shot by Bogues, no good. Bogues is gone, just three of ten shooting from the field. Pass to Williams. Here's Wade. Fades. Yep, that one goes. Wade's got five points now in the quarter. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on them. Now here's Carter. 14 points for him. Walker on the double team. Shot clock at six. You know, that's how you do it, guys. I mean, he passed his way out of the double team and into an easy basket. Now here's Williams. Not a lot of room. Here's O'Neal. And he says right back at you with a big dunk of his own. Well, here's a center who can put up 40, 50, 60. I mean, there's really no limit to what Shaq can do scoring the basketball. Pulls it from 20. And it's Miami with a rebound. Haslam's got six rebounds now in the game. Here's Wade. He's checked by Carter. Back to Williams. Takes a three. And it's Toronto with a rebound. Oakley's got rebound number eight now. Pass to McGrady. Hands it with nobody near him. McGrady's got 18 points in the game. Man, he's on fire. Playing patient basketball, not forcing shots. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Allie LaForce. 
Brian, Commissioner Adam Silver has done a 180. Once in favor of raising the NBA age limit to 20, he now supports lowering it back to 18. He said it's the right thing to do, adding that the opportunity to work with players at a younger age on not just skills, but mental health, diet, character, and values could be in everyone's best interest. BA? Well, it didn't happen yet, Allie. We'll see. Here's Oakley. Give him eight. Here's Carter. And it's Toronto with another. And here is Williams. Oh, there's the alley. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. He got him good there. I mean, that's why the shot was so far off. You've done this, One falls for him. And that's good as he hits both shots. Well, it's going to take something special now to get him back in this game. Unfortunately, it just doesn't seem likely. Here's Davis, and finished oh, off by Davis. Boy, a great dunker. Davis showing off his unique talents there. Here's Wade. He's checked by Carter. Crafty move. Oh, oh, man. Oh, oh, man. Oh, oh, oh. Punch that one. Bad mm. intentions. Mm. Mm. Oh, 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 how good was that? D-Wade throwing it down. Carter with it. 16 points for him. There's a screen. Pass to Oakley. Back to Carter. Just five to shoot. The Raptors need to get off the shot. And finished off by Davis. And this guy, to me, embodies determination. Small at his position. But he still gets up and keeps plays alive. That's mind over matter for sure. Here's Haslam. He's got 11. No luck on that one. Here's Boats. Outside Carter. Davis, a screen. Shoots from the line. And the Raptors He's getting fine. another bucket right there. Great to see players still working the in-between areas. There wasn't much resistance defensively. Here's Wade. He's checked by Carter. Oh, oh my. big time right there. Yes, well, you see how Wade adjusts to whatever the defense throws at it? Strong finish there. Pass to McGrady. All alone. And it's in. Off the glass. McGrady's got 10 points here in the second half. And Miami has possession. Outside, Williams. Here's Wade. Fires the three. Here's O'Neal. Back to Wade. Pass to Walker. Here's Haslam. And count the basket. He was fouled, and he's going to the line for one more. So both teams making some changes here. McGrady. 20 points for him. Outside Carter. They set the screen. 
Haslam with a rebound. And it's the Heat with the ball. Here's Posey. He's got five. Anderson passes to Posey. Brown against Payton. Clock at six. Pass to O'Neal. It's intercepted. Here's Christie. Haslam with a rebound. Haslam's got nine rebounds now. Left side, Anderson. On the wing, Peyton. Defended by Brown. Tries to spin move. Peyton's shot is good. Oh, how about Gary Peyton? Silky look, working his way in close to the basket to make sure he got what he wanted in close. Pass to McGrady. Back to Carter. Here's Willis. Second chance shot. And he lays it in. Yeah, the strength of Kevin Willis really impressive. And he does a nice job positioning for offensive rebounds. Here's Haslam. O'Neal passes to Payton. Shot from 16. And it's Toronto with another. There's 48 seconds left in the third quarter. Pass to Haslam. O'Neal inside. 16 points for him. And the ball is tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Now Peyton. Five to shoot. And he's going for the lob! You've got to keep a body on O'Neal. I know it's easier said than done. Or if you don't, he's going to eat you alive on the lob. Five-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Pass to Christie. There's a screen. Inside. Here's Willis. Chalk up two there. Willis has got his second basket on the night. With the rock inside, hey, Willis has one thing on his mind. Let's go to work. Right side, Anderson. That misses. Would have counted had it gone. And so it's Miami continuing to pile it on. Up 22 as we head to the break. It hasn't taken them too many shots to get their points. They're winning with efficiency. More 2K action in just a moment. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same for the first three quarters. And so here is Miami. So for the Raptors right now. And it's Christie in at the three. Payton passes to Morning. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Using his size to get defenses to foul him. The big man, Alonzo Mourning, doing good work there. No good on the free throw. He's a guy that has some fire to him, both on the floor and in the locker room. You know, Morning is that guy that loves to motivate himself and his teammates. So neither attempt will fall that time for him. And here are the Raptors now. Carter on the wing. Oh, 
to the middle. Here's Willis. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Willis, a towering presence. This guy is tall and well put together. A seven-footer who's able to go at the defense inside and draw the foul. That free throw, no good. A vocal presence both on the floor and in the locker room. Willis is somebody his teammates really respects. That one misses. And it's Miami's ball. Here's Peyton. Sweet little floater. It's really one of the key shots in Peyton's arsenal. That little floater over the top. Peyton's gotten all three of his shots to fall. Three for three. Outside Carter. To the right side. They set a pick. Shot from 12. Nice shot by Christie. Christie has the athleticism and skill to beat you from all three levels. Pass to Morning. Now Peyton. And stolen by Brown. To the inside, Christie. Yes, it's good. Really good move by Christie inside. Finding a way to beat that tight defense. And it's Miami's ball. Here's Wade. Outside Peyton. Fires the three. Drains the triple. And, you know, even though he's not a lights-out shooter from deep, the defense still has to be more aggressive there. And Brown has got the ball here for Toronto. Pass to Christie. From 13. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. Second team foul. At the line for the Raptors, Doug Christie. Two shots. He makes a first. Anderson's checked in for Miami. And he makes both free throws. And we're about two minutes into the fourth now. Pass to Posey. Brown against Peyton. Six to shoot. Again gets it to go. He can't miss. Five for five. A master at dicing and slicing up defenses. Peyton excels at reading pick and rolls and capitalizing in them. Right side, Carter. Top of the key. Here's Willis. he jams it home with authority. Way to go upstairs, Kevin Willis. Pulling off that nasty throwdown. Here's Wade. And let's face it, they won't get back in the game with fouls like that. Look to me like just a frustration foul. It really kind of sums up the game they're having in general. Haslam, he's checked in for Anderson. And Toronto also making a switch. Davis is checked in. Here's Wade. Long range from the inbound. Called in by Brown. Fourth quarter keeps moving along. Three minutes gone by now. Pass to Davis. Back to Brown. Fires for three. Rebounded by Morning. 
Morning's got four rebounds in the game. And here's Peyton, defended by Brown. Here's Wade, out to the right wing. Here's Haslam. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Wade. There's the double team with Carter. Here's Haslam. Connects from downtown. Haslam's got 10 points in just the second half. This is what it's been since halftime. Remarkable results from downtown. Boy, it's been a three-point barrage. They came out gunning and have not stopped. Here's Davis, and it's good. Fought through contact, hit the shot, and will go to the line. At the line for the Raptors, Antonio Davis. At the line for one. college Antonio Davis played a few years in Europe which allowed him a chance to refine his game Wade the pass to Haslam here's Wade he's checked by Carter lets it fly and it's Posey missing can't blame him just trying to take what the defense allows outside Carter Releases from 15. Davis misses. So it's Miami now. Now Peyton. Pass to Posey. Shoots over Brown. Posey's shot is good. Boy, what a clean pass by Peyton that time. He sees a ready shooter and gets it to him at just the right time. Here's Willis. Back to Brown. to the paint and the basket by Willis want to score in the NBA picks can really force the D to make tough choices Willis has gone four of five shooting from the field pass to Posey on the wing Wade softly drops in the floater Wade's got 11 points here in the second half how about that wonderful floater he has Showing off an exquisite touch. Here's Willis. Oh, stolen by Peyton. Here's Posey. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. Transition basketball. The most reliable way to generate easy looks. Yep, exactly. And if there's any opportunity for early offense, you've got to push it and push it every time. Now here's Carter. Outside, Brown. Shot clock at six. Davis with a screen on Peyton. Here's Brown to the left side wing. Christie. Good. And Brown gets the assist. Brown's got his fourth assist in this one. Got to be careful with Christie at the arc. He's got solid accuracy on his shot from there. Here's Morning. Wade drives in. Again, the Heat score. And so it's Carter who brings up the ball for the Raptors. Pass to Willis. Davis, a screen. Shoots from 12. Rebounded by Morning. Morning's got rebound number five here tonight. Brown against Payton. Down low. And he throws it down. What a terrific lead pass. And, you know, we can't measure Hart. I mean, he's not as big as the other power forwards, but his jumping ability and mindset is incredible. Now here's Carter. Pass to Willis. And here's Carter. From deep. And Posey pulls it down. 
And looks like an illegal pick was set. That gets the ref's attention. Well, the league has put an emphasis to crack down on illegal screens. Yeah, you know, he might have gotten away with that a few years ago, but not anymore. No way. Now you've got to be stationary on those screens. No extra hips or elbows, or they'll call it. Here's McGrady. Walker covering. McGrady, the pass to Oakley. The enforcer of this team without question. Charles Oakley intimidates the opposition. And that's a big deal for this squad. At the line for the Raptors, Charles Oakley. Two shots. First one falls. Both good from the line that time. And the heat with possession. Pass to right. The teardrop. It's tipped. Excellent job by McGrady using his length to deny that shot. Carter against Payton. A shot from the mid-range. Carter, good. Carter's got 20. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Now here's Brown. Pass to Peyton. Knocks down the 18-footer. Gary Payton, very comfortable from this range. Payton's gotten everything to fall, shooting six for six on the night. They set the pick. Bogues, the pass to Carter. Launches it from deep. They grab their own miss. And he gets that one. Davis has got nine points here in the second half. Boy, look at Davis making the extra effort, doing what it takes to get the ball and get a shot of his own. Right on the left side. Carter against Payton. Clock at six. Shoots over Davis. Payton, no good. He just couldn't finish the job that time. And too bad, because it was a nice look. Pass to Bogues. Here's McGrady. Rebounded by Morning. Morning's got six rebounds in the game. Right outside. Outside, Brown. Now here's right. Outside, Brown. Here's Peyton. Good. And Brown gets the assist. That's why Peyton's teammates have confidence in him and trust him. Because he understands when he should take these quick shots. Outside, Carter. We're ready, we're ready, we're ready. Pass to Oakley. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. Here's McGrady. Hounded by Wright. There's the double with Wright. Let's it fly. And the shot clock expires. 24-second violation. And the fans love seeing incredible moments on defense like that block. Oh, amazing indeed. And getting stops like that only encourages them to keep attacking on the offensive end. Michael Doliak. Shendon Anderson. One fifty-two left to play in the fourth quarter. Right wing. And there's a pick. Raptors foul. Charles Oakley. Third personal foul. Third team foul.
Anderson passes to Posey. Outside Peyton. Down to five on the shot clock. The Heat need to get one up in a hurry. Look at the power on that. He has to be one of the top dunkers in the game today. Absolutely salivates when he attacks the rim. Bogues, the pass to Carter. 116 left in the game. Pass to Oakley. Here's McGrady. That shot off the mark. Now here's Peyton. Here's Posey. 50 seconds left to play in the fourth. Stepping up and nailing an important shot to put this away. And, you know, this run shows what kind of attitude this team has. I mean, the win is there. Go get it. Here's McGrady. To halt the run, here's Davis. Drops in the layup for two. Really good work inside from Davis, proving how effective he can be down there. There's 31 seconds left to play in the fourth. Payton passes to Morning. Here's Posey. Got it. James Posey. 20 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Outside Carter. And there's the screen. And he comes up with a bucket. Yeah, watching Carter find his rhythm. Very impressive. An efficient scorer who can hurt you in a lot of ways. So no problem for Miami as they get the win. They didn't have too many problems tonight. They didn't. Just a tremendous team effort. Once they had that big lead, they were not going to let the visitors back into the game. And that'll do it, folks. For Clark Kellogg, Grant Hill, and Allie LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching as we present the New Balance Player of the Game.